faster and learn, see? Watch and learn. You're gonna get us killed one of these days. Maybe. But at least you'll kick it with a smile on your face and your balls in the right place. Looking for someone. Asian-American woman, about 30. Seen anyone like that? Well, it doesn't ring a bell. But shit. <laughs> you can't ask her to meet at a bar like a normal chew? You pull the night shift? Well, we could call it my part of the deal. And an old habit from the Badlands. So, you were nomad? I was. Once upon a time. Abandon your family? I betrayed them. I'd rather not get into it. Sup, V? Shoot some shit with me? Then spill it, my man. Working for the press. What's it like? Feds probably pay stacks, yeah? Every hour brings new challenges. Can't tell you more than that. Yo, no doubt, no doubt. Hang with the right peeps? I bet the whole world opens its legs. Business trips, Lux hotels, Joy Toys on demand, Gannick meat, happy hour in orbit. I mean, shit. Like a fucking rock star. <laughs> like a fucking rock star. Anyway, you made a wise choice for an overnight. Safe, out of the way. It's even got work and power. Mentioned airdrops before. What's that about? It's like this. Colonel Hansen runs a big market, but he's landlocked, right? Gotta get his shipments in somehow. Talking iron, ammo, meds, fucking anything. All falling out of the sky and into Kurt's lap. Now, if you know where and when to look, might fall into your lap instead. Feel me? Telling me fighters keepers? Clepping from Kurt? It's kid stuff. Trickle down economics, I call it. So, one thing I don't get. Building's safe, right? So why is it a total ghost town? Right. <laughs> See, well, that's because it's haunted. You ain't never heard the stories, dog. Jacob. It's true. A lot of peeps died here. Mysterious circumstances. Like an aneurysm, each and every one. One time, 12 runners they found. All their brains fried. Hansen closed the house down, banned entry. And the Colonel's word means lots more than some turrets and shit. Folks know to stay away. So what are we still doing here? Cause fuck them, that's what. And fuck urban legends. Finally. Legs are killing me. Come on, take a. Still nothing from So Me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. How you feel about our roommates? None too bright, but not entirely useless. And two extra guns could always prove handy. Gonna give them that payday, really? Why wouldn't I? They're taking a sizable risk. So, what if Songbird don't show? We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well... Then... We'll have one other option to consider. But let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. Hmm. See you in the morning, V. She's on the balcony.
She's not here. Means she's not coming. Seen the swarms Hansen has out hunting? Might have nabbed her. Possibility. One that concerns me the most. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Could it still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Listen, when we had a calm night, but you gotta leave Dogtown. How? In a car trunk? Fingers crossed? Hansen's waiting for that sort of desperate attempt. Okay. There gotta be a way. Let me think. Know my share of fixers. Bet we could get one Out to... of the question. They'll hand me over to the highest bidder. Got a talk backup plan. Not a plan. A man. The kind we need. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intelligence efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With the conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. A sleeper agent? No shit. Tell me more. Unless that's like a state secret or whatever. It is. Of the false bottom drawer variety. Let's say you want to secure your interests on another country's soil. If diplomacy fails, you resort to other means. Like a military coup. That's one option. Solomon Reed is another sure one. Seven years undercover. Guy sounds like a true asset. Used to be with Arasaka once upon a time. Counter intel. Never saw any read on file. Above your pay grade, maybe? Consider that. Maybe I was too busy getting my hands wet and dirty. So, that's a yes. Go back, up your clearance, and check again. Hard pass. Closed chapter in my life. Good. Although Reed is likely to keep it open. Why? War's been over for seven years. For some, wars never end. How do I find your guy? Guessing I can't just buzz him on his work hollow. Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. What now? Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. Meaning an analog landline. That crash tear open a hole in space-time? When sending sensitive information, you use the technology least vulnerable to interception, old or not. That Caliente should still be wired for it. Owner have a thing for antiques? He had a thing for federal money. And he might still be alive. Remember, 0931. Okay, seems doable. And I prefer discretion to destruction. I trust that's clear. Uh-huh. So what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the... the file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Tell me I'm a special agent now. That's right. But taking the oath make it feel more real. Secret comms line, presidential token. What's next? A coded message in today's scream sheet? That token is for your safety. If Reed isn't 100% certain I sent you, he won't hesitate to kill you. Yeah, nah. Let's skip the formal thing. Is there a problem? It's just a big commitment, you know? Can't swear to something I don't believe in. It's your choice. I understand this was sudden. Good luck out there, V. 
and don't let the bastards nab you. Where's Jacob? Fresh airdrop nearby. Jay went down for a look-see. Sleep okay? Night all right? Like any with a roof overhead. Claustrophobic. As for Jacob, he thrives in dreamland. Come on, baby. Ever ridden in a Rayfield? My villa with VIP friends? High society? On and on till the crack of dawn. A man with ambitions, clearly. Those in a deviated septum. The right call not taking that fascist ass oath. Oh, yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. How'd you come to that? Because with the biz done, their arm will still be far up your ass and you'll be a meat puppet. No, I was once at Corpo Jarhead, right? Practically dove into uniform head first. They had a real hard-on for the oath. Repeat after me, bloody fucking blah. But can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. Sure you want to talk about this? Gotta hand it to you, V. Wiser than I was back in the day. Well, look who's away. See that crazy color smoke? Yep, wham bam. One of Hanson's cargo drops, no doubt. She all yours. I sure as shit ain't making that climb. Don't wanna climb or you're not telling me something? You think I'm finna parkour up on one leg? Thanks for the heads up. Maybe I'll take a look. Sure thing. the Sierra Nevadas. Um, only did the one gig for you, far as I recall. Mm. And let's not forget our torrid tale of Haitians, Netrunners, and animals. You could not have made contact with the VDBs without me. Your source for adventure I am, in Dogtown as elsewhere. So, we finally got to meet in person? I can say neither yes nor no. In lieu of an answer, I've new work for you. I hope you'll accept. One last thing. How you breach Dogtown's border, I'm not certain. Though, I suspect not via the main gate. Irrelevant in any case. I've secured clearance for your future convenience. Your name and likeness now registered in the system, granting unfettered passage over the district threshold. Talk again soon.
fuck! Captain, you tracking me in Dogtown? No, no, not you, the car. Listen, I'll explain, but first, you gotta bring her to me. Flipping you the courts. We are not the sheep, we were made to rule. No, we are not the sheep, we were made to rule. We like to watch. We like to taste. We like to
Scan this motherfucker. Gonk to get supreme looking, but useless. At least with you, it's the other way around. Wait, what? Ah, <laughs> relax. Just teasing, man. Anyway, come on. If I wanted my dick wet, I wouldn't stand out in the rain. This one's stolen, too. Stolen? Oh, V, you're breaking my heart. Give it to me straight, Cap. The wheels. What's your scheme? Got a need for speed, huh? Yeah, me too. But first, I'm not gonna haze you. The car you brought's looking a little worse for wear. Every scratch is a loss, you feel me? Two, I'm selling them. Three, Dogtown's full of chances, and chances are what I like. Four, you called it a scheme? Man, I prefer to call it a, a creative license. You know, issues with the electronics in the Mizutani Xion MZ2 were usually the onboard comp's fault. Could help you out, take a look. Whoa, 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 V, boundaries, please. There are certain things I don't do halfway. I'm talking my clothes, my cut, my cars. I'll handle her myself. Wanted to ask about those speed bumps I ran into. Ah, uh, Sixth Street? Just a little biz disagreement. Better get used to bumps like that if you want to work with me. Right. What's this creative endeavor need from me? Gonna need you ready to grab some easy ads. Listen, I got like a gift. A sixth sense. Huh? I can tell when a ride's bored. Needs a change of hands. Sometimes I hear him calling over in Dogtown. Sometimes in Night City. Right. And this sixth sense tells you to tell me to bring him to this chop shop? Oh, chop shop. Well, please. But. Yeah, you rein in the wheels, you rake in the heads. Of course, it's all part of a larger plan. Well, well. Picked up a tail, huh? Hmm. Could shoot him up. Just one measly Relax, cop car. we're in my hood. Let's see what they want. NCPD, asshole. You got a license and a ridge for them ugly mugs? I don't fucking believe this. Badge has got a talent for looking the other way. Suggest you try using it. The mouth on this one. Training them better and better. Daniels, the fuck, man? You take a fucking squad car to pick up a clipped ride in uniform? Not the only one on his home turf, mama. Hey. Nabaville Fort Alvarado for the top breast, too. I'll get the gear for our little plan. Hold the phone. El Cap handing out bribes? <laughs> I'm shocked. Shocked. There an honest cop left in this city? There is. But they lay low. Don't got that fire in their eyes, you know? Prim, thanks for the cred. Cars, deeds, and docks are on their way. You see? It's just biz. Come on, rain stopped. Okay, you just met one of our clients. So, in on the gig? What's this plan you and Daniels mentioned? Hmm, you drive for me, and you find out. In due time. So, you taking the gig or not? Always driving somewhere. Might as well pick up some scratch on the way. You gonna make it worth my while? Come on, man. With El Capitan, your future's looking bright. I fix you your gigs, your fancy payouts, nothing but upsides. Counting on it. Sure, sure. Let's see what tomorrow brings. El Capitan will be en contacto.
NCPD officers are in need of rescue. And who but you could save those sworn to protect us? Now, these two little piggies went to market and struck a deal with one of Hansen's men, Dodger. What could go wrong, you think? Correct. Everything. Stella, the fiancé of one of our officers, will fill you in. Best of luck. Get down. Can't get spotted by Dodger's men. Wouldn't it be easier to just move the car? Folding the seats might not cut it. Listen, this is serious, okay? You don't mess with Dodger's people. Okay, <laughs> sure. Need your help with my fiancé, Bill, and his buddy, Charlie. They're trapped in the building across the street. Hans mentioned they're both NCPD. Both grade A gonks, too. Sometimes do side gigs around town. Wanted to cut a deal with Dodger, but things obviously went south. Bill called me from inside, said only that, and I quote, it's bad. And if I don't get help, Dodger will paint the walls with their brains. So you, Bill, and Charlie are all badges with a whole precinct full of badge tombs at your back, but instead you call a merc. Dodger's not exactly a legit businessman. Can't call dispatch for this. They'll crucify us. So Bill's your fiance, Charlie's his partner. What else can you tell me about him? Bill. Bill's a good guy, but Charlie? He's like the big older brother that gets you into all kinds of shit. Okay, so we don't like Charlie. Look, Night City's turned all of us into who we are, but Charlie? He's a fucking magnet for trouble. Always has been. It's bad. Nothing else. It's really bad, Stella. Please get help. I love you. <laughs> Sweet of him, but not really what I was after. When I asked what happened, he said it was too complicated for a quick hollow. Why's Dodger got you all shaken at the knees? He's a dealer with close ties to Hansen. Total psycho, too. Moved to Dogtown to avoid serious prison time. Just please try not to wipe Dodger's men. You'll make things go from bad to worse. Take this access card. Dodger took over an abandoned NCPD precinct. Security systems are still up and running. So this should get you in without a hitch. Upsides of last-gen NCPD tech, huh? Save them. Please. Now, motherfucker.
to Papa. There's a switch to the right. Use it. My right or your right? My fucking right! Hello? Who's asking, Charlie or Bill? It's Charlie. So Stella did manage to find someone. Thank fuck. Okay, let's try to get this open. Fucking slab this thing. Little help. Better step back. Jesus fucking Christ. I know. What the fuck? Don't worry. Not my blood. <laughs> the hell happened? Uh, better see for yourself. It's just through here. What in the... This is Bill. Hi. Who's your friend? Uh, who, me? Just told you, I I'm Bill. Thanks, Bill, got that. No, I mean the dead fucking body on the table you somehow failed to mention to Stella. We, we didn't kill him, okay? We, we, we swear. Let's see. Two blood-soaked dudes locked in a room with a gutted corpse. Yeah, real puzzler. Bet it'd take ages for a detective to unravel this one. Go on. Tell him about your genius idea. My idea? You're the one Plan who set up the deal with was Dodger! was rock fucking solid! If only you didn't leave a bag of drugs in front of a junkie! How was I supposed to know he'd swallow it? You say drugs? Oh, you go! No, you! 
I swear to fucking God. When like this. Choom over here clips Dodger's shit. Hightails it to NC. We catch wind, Dodger's put out a bounty to bag him. Bring back his nose candy. Bump right into him during a routine stop. Dumb fucking luck. Choom was carrying seven ounces of Sin Coke. So we cuffed him. Took him here. Jim swallowed seven whole ounces? That, that even possible? So we're here, waiting on Dodger, when Bill pops the baggie on the table like it's nothing. All of a sudden, this gonk turd yells, Fuck you, pigs, and stuffs the bag in his mouth! Could've had a food tube implant? Like a deep, wide throat? Yeah, like the one your mom's got. Fuck you even talking about, Bill! Couldn't get him to just spit it out? We tried to make a trek. Oh, tr track it. Tra fuck. Poke a fucking hole in his neck. No dice. Bag must have broke because he got all foamy at the mouth. Started spazzing out and then just croaked. That's when we started to panic. This fool gulped tens of thousands worth of eddies. What the fuck else are we supposed to do? Stella was right. You two are bona fide jackasses. We panicked, all right? Shit happens. <sighs> this... It's all gone. Dissolved. And now Dodger's gonna end us. So you bring him the thief who swiped his dope. Only now there's no thief. Or dope. Yeah. It's about the gist of it. You gotta help us get out of here. All right, let's get moving. One last tiny thing. Came here in our squad car and, uh, kinda need it back. Just keeps getting better. Where is it? In the garage. To the garage we it's go. It's official, V. Finally made it to the major leagues. League of first class leadheads, to be precise. Nice of you to join us, Johnny. Still Always value your input. If he finds out what we did, I'm a dead man walking. Know what you could use? What? A nice big pair of balls. Oh, cause you're such a tough guy? Not like you stutter in front of the cap every fucking time. I don't fucking stutter. Let us through here before. What was the code again? 2893? It was 2983. Idiot, it was 2893. Saw him punch it. Go on. Didn't work. Ha! <laughs> 2983. I fucking told you. I just go. Careful. Huh? Hey, this wasn't us, okay? Gotta be a switch around here somewhere. Dodger will drown us in eddies, Bill. The plan is foolproof, Bill. Trust me, I know what I'm saying, Bill. <sighs> Shut up, Bill. So what if it's fucking Pacifica? What, too pussy to set foot there, Bill? Afraid of earning some serious scratch? Says the asshole who couldn't keep a bag in his fucking pocket. Got it. They're coming! Do something! 
thing. cars right through here you do have them don't you the keys shit wait don't tell me you left them upstairs chill chum got them right here these two to help oh they look like they could use a hand all right one thing i can't put my finger on though what's that you got on your faces a little ketchup run out of napkins uh yeah well uh, no not us per se you any better at speaking full sense um uh, there was a shootout a, a, a guy got hit it was, was bleeding out fast. Uh, after that, brought your stuff here. Uh, left it all upstairs, so it's all good. Another smooth talker. All right. Third time's a charm. Is he spinning yarns? It's all true. Happened exactly as Bill said. That's unfortunate. See, I really don't like being made a fool of. Boys. Eat shit, psycho! Oh. It's safe to come out. Dodger ain't breathing. Yup, nothing left but hop in your ride, flee the scene. Sure you can manage that much. Thanks. So are we going or what? Yeah, yeah. Hey, thanks again. Okay, I'll radio us in, tell him we're back. Wait, I'll get Stella. Put it this way, this is the last time I do a gig for the badges. Prickly today, are we? I'll make do without details. If the client is happy, then so am I. Contract closed. Let's 
たのお疲れ様でした。